Okay, guys, this is a very basic course which will not take more than 10 minutes in which I would like to show you bit by bit, step by step, how to create your online course based on Moodle a learning environment. This is a learning environment used mostly by educational institutions, universities, uh, but not only. It's uh, open source, that's why a lot of people use it and it's uh, absolutely very useful to know it. I'm a filmmaker so I would like to create a course today on which uh, lens to use for uh, making videos and uh, I would like to make a course with three small sections um, one text, second one with a video and the last one a forum where people can share information about which lenses are best for them and in 10 minutes I will be able to uh, do that and you will be able to do that too when you follow my instructions and also play and pause whenever you need to go ahead let's do it so i'm going to um, open the learning environment in which uh, the course will be created i'm going to log in there you should receive your login also from your course administrator um, this will probably look differently definitely uh, don't be scared i mean uh, definitely uh, if the uh, look will um, however uh, contain a part with login in the probably in the top right corner and the navigation dashboard probably on the left and in the navigation dashboard it mostly is about courses uh, and to create a course I'm going to create click on courses yeah please first more important information click on courses and add a new course button yeah and this is very important um, course category it can be in templates but if I want to create a course it should be in courses this is very important because then later you will not be able to find it my course name will be a best uh, uh, what uh, 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 what are the best lenses for filmmaking course short name will be similar because it's pretty short uh, and I'm going to click on okay in course summary of course I can write something as well um, and I just click save and display button okay and enrolled users you can see this appeared in the middle uh, in what previously used to be empty uh, enrolled users are also none uh, uh, so it doesn't really bother me now I'm going to go to I'm going to actually click on the name of the course what are the best lenses for filmmaking it appears in the navigation dashboard but also up I uh, usually mm, um, and what is there is a blank page in the middle now yeah because we need to fill it in and to fill it in now another very important thing to do is to turn click on the button usually top right corner but not always turn editing on I click on it and then click on the edit uh, also very important underneath edit section yeah which will be the first section I create the first section I create is actually um, what to remember about lenses and I can fill in uh, well uh, basic info or whatever I need to click on save changes and the first section appears yeah basic stuff usually introductory I can even let me actually add uh, go back and add a picture of myself um, maybe something nice that people might like uh, browse uh, repositories attach add file um, yeah and upload the file description for uh, for people who are cannot see or are using screen readers and other software save image and
the image is there yeah save changes okay so it's being displayed there in the first section underneath the text that we had it's a pretty neat picture but this is not all i want to go to the next uh, actually add a new section uh, clicking on the plus icon uh, which can be difficult to find so please make sure you find it very often it will be just a plus um, i um, change the topic one uh, which appears into uh, well uh, best lenses for video uh, making by professionals and as part of this section I would like to show a um, video actually which I found on YouTube I would like to uh, put it there because there's a lot of good content already out there which you can include just make sure you um, give the credit to the author yeah so I've done just that and I click save changes what happens now I've been redirected to my course page as you can see underneath the first section uh, with the picture we can see next section which contains video top five best lens for DSLR filmmaking yeah now I'd like to create the final section for today before we finish and this will be actually it and you will be actually have created your first course yeah I'm going to add the third section increase the number of sections um, and it will be a forum yeah what is very important forum is much different than the first parts because this is not a resource which is information either be it audio form text or video but a resource is something that enables interaction between you the instructor who is me in that case or your other users or both so i'm going to add an activity and um, it's going to be called the exchange sharing forum for uh, beginning filmmakers and I'm going to add an activity there and the activity is going to be a forum yeah there are much more activities but for today's first the only one you need to know it's an activity which enables discussions between users um, of the course the, going, clicking to add after clicking on add what happens next i can click the name of the forum uh well forum for camera people uh, i can write anything in the description and i just click save and display yeah save and return to course is not good to click because you can just find yourself lost sometime somewhere a uh, forum for camera people is there i can add a new discussion topic if i want to uh, i don't have time for that because the time is running out so i'm just going to click on again on the name of the course uh, and i would like to go back to the course page again for the last to sum up what we have learned today uh, the first section is there with the picture second section is there with the video third section is there with the forum where people can exchange information between each other yeah so this is it actually guys we have created a course for beginning filmmakers about which lenses they are can use so the same you can do with anything that you want to with anything mm, only learning you would like people to uh, to uh, benefit uh, from so thank you for this uh, very much i hope it was clear in case you have any questions you're welcome to actually post them on our forum <laughs> uh, and discuss maybe we can improve something uh, so good luck with creating your first online course based on moodle this was tomek kozakiewicz speaking to you from thailand ciao